offenkundige Bestimmung. Earl Phelps, a shooting at the 111 Club, 6232 Hollywood Boulevard. Sounds like a homicide beef. Two of the dead guys caught in the crossfire were carrying army surplus morphine. Get over there before homicide tramples all over the place. We already cleared that up. Judge in Pasadena took the big sleep yesterday. He had a personal stash of 20 cigarettes. Appears we didn't get all of it. Na super. Ganz großartiger Fall, den wir uns da aufgejabelt haben am Anfang. Everyone has their vices. Even you, Phelps. You got a stakeout down on second later tonight. Was hab ich denn damit zu tun? Hey, I gave his Moin. wife a tap. I said all's fair in love and war. Gott, da ist so ein Labyrinth hier unten immer. Wahnsinn. Komm irgendwie mit dieser... Mit diesem Gebäude nicht zurecht. Naja. Gut, einsteigen und zum Tatort. Ray. Roy meine ich, nicht Ray. Okay. Parker and Green are going toe to toe for the top job. There's a change in the wind. About time. This wind will be like a tornado, Phelps. Parker's got a puritanical streak. You never know we'll get swept up in a thing like that. Any in the vicinity officer needs assistance. 1825 North Highland Avenue, 1825 North Highland Avenue. Ja, ja, ja. Irgendwann machen wir die mal. So, und da müssen wir aber auch fast da sein. Gespräch war ja sehr kurz, und ich. Was ja immer dafür spricht, dass der Ort nicht so weit ist. So, da steht die ganze Polizei rum. One Eleven Club. 16 Uhr 23. Bukowski. Phelps. Back again. We're here about the morphine. Over by the bandstand. You can see what's left of the owner, Eddie McGoldrick. 26, former Marine. I know Eddie McGoldrick. He was a non-com in my old unit. I'm sorry to hear that, Cole. Waitress said he recently came into some money and bought the club. Who are the other Vicks? Two musicians, Biddleston and Bo. Get this, they used to be in a four-piece, but the trombone player and the drummer OD'd. Don't tell me. Lamont and Tyree? We've met the rest of the band. Now they're a no-piece. <laughs> Do you mind if we take a look around? Be my guest. You might want a word with the hostess, too. I'll keep her company until you're ready. Natürlich, Bukowski. Must have pumped a dozen rounds into him. Certainly sends a message. Ja, das ist definitiv eine Message. Das sind Zigaretten? Ja, okay, unwichtig. Auch die Kippe daneben ist wohl unwichtig. So, wir gucken uns erstmal außen um. Wenn du bereit bist, eine zivile Konversation zu haben, können wir es versuchen. Von 11 Club, ich denke nicht, dass das wichtig ist. Weil wir sind ja schon da. Warte. So, da ist die Hostess, mit der reden wir gleich. Ja, unwichtig. Gut, dann gucken wir uns doch erstmal hier um. So, haben wir hier in der Bar noch irgendwas? Unwichtig. Da liegt doch eine Spritze, oder? Ne. What? What? Nochmal. Ach so, ja. Okay. Gut, dann gehen wir mal ins hintere Zimmerchen. Das war eine Flasche. Okay, die Instrumente kann man sicher gucken. Hier ist der zweite Tote. Biddleston. Im Gesicht werden wir wohl nicht viel erkennen, oder? Wo ist eigentlich? Cocoon? Mel? 
Kann ich eigentlich auch hier mit das drehen? Ich kann es auch mit den Pfeiltasten, das ist da viel angenehmer. Wie mit der Maus habe ich so echt meine Probleme. Nein! Lass das Gesicht in Ruhe. Phelps. Nein! Phelps! Sag mal, bist du blöd? Okay, alles safe. Nothing. Ach ja, kick mal einer an. Nein, er liest das nicht wieder vor, oder? Oh, für Tetra. Ja, ich weiß. Phelps, ich weiß. Wir haben eine neue Source. Oder ist das aus dem, was in Zirkulation ist? Circulation? Nobody knows. So, hier ist C. Also. Ne? Wo ist denn... Was? Delivered tobacco. Army surplus again. A Goldrick must have been moving contraband through the club. Vom Kunden nach Lieferung auszufüllen. Okay. Zigaretten, Gewicht, Boxen, Schiff, SS Coolridge. Name David Lungo. Yet. We could check on the serial numbers. Is this guy hunting for bear? Look at these things. They're BARs. You get the odd guy who sneaks one of them home from the war. How did he get three of them? Hm. Kann ich mir die anderen auch nochmal angucken? Das ist ich nicht, oder? Nein. Es fehlen aber irgendwie zwei. Ach, da ist B, der Koffer. Seht ihr? Ach, hier ist auch. Carathus, so heißt er. Hm. Well maintained, custom case. Someone cared for this instrument. Ah. Was ist das Klick? Ich wollte gerade sagen, ich muss wahrscheinlich irgendeine Reihenfolge oder so machen. Neat trick. Das Kass muss mehr als der Trumpet sein. Ticket. Der Blue Room Jazz Club. Ticket. Wir sollten auf den Musikangel folgen. Und eine Spritze? Ich habe die Stash close at hand. Morphine. Ich kann alle die guten Dinge finden. Ist in der Trompete noch was drin? Wahrscheinlich nicht mehr. Nein. Okay. Also den Koffer haben wir auch. Take a look around, Phelps. Looks like a straightforward execution to me. Oh, hier ist ein Hut. Gut, den Hut können wir nicht nehmen. Dann quatschen wir mal. Ma'am, I'm Detective Phelps. Administrative by Squad. Welcome to the 111 Club, Detective. Feels like I've had half the LAPD in here today already. Das ist ja schön. Any idea who did the shooting? No idea. It was my day off. If I had been here, honey, I'd be full of holes just like the others. Uh. Wanna level with me, miss, before we start taking an interest in you. This place has been on a slide for years. Eddie turns up, buys the club, then we start getting visits from tough guys. Next thing you know, we have the St. Valentine's Day Massacre. Are you getting the picture? Yep. Eddie McGoldrich. Tell us about Eddie. Eddie didn't know a thing about running a nightclub. He came into some money and waltzed in and bought the place. The previous owner thought all his Christmases had come at once. Ja, okay. Macht ja Sinn. Where do you think he got the money? My guess was that he was selling the sort of quality product that you don't need to advertise. <laughs> Thank you for your help, ma'am. Eddie was in over his head, but he was a decent boss. 
Ja, okay. Case solved, würde ich sagen. Eddie hat sich mit den falschen Leuten eingelassen und wurde erschossen. Muss ja so sein. Oh, was ist denn hier los? Mich verarschen? Ist ja noch jemand tot? Bad luck, Eddie. Okinawa couldn't kill you. Knowing the wrong people in this city. Ach, das ist Eddie. Ah. I remember. Okay. Stimmt, die anderen beiden waren die Musiker. Okay, nothing. Was hat er in seine Pockets? Nix. Nix. Hör auf. Okay. They didn't even try to crack the safe. Aha. Punching back. Nein, lass den Safe in Ruhe. Aha. Okay. Ja, wahrscheinlich habe ich nur irgendeinen Hinweis übersehen. Und Bekowski, Alter. Du bist ja hier, aber... Ganz fein hinterher. Wo ist denn unser Partner? Roy? Da ist er. Roy? Roy? Advice? Best search the place, Cole. What? All the rooms. Joint like this could have some funny stuff lying around. Scheiße. Gut, okay, wir müssen mal ganz kurz Intuition benutzen. Zwei sind noch übrig. Oh, ich hätte die Zigaretten auch an, äh, aufmachen können. Army Surplus Morphine, Army Surplus Weapons, Army Surplus Valors. Sound familiar? We should get back to the station and check the details of what exactly was lifted from that ship. A dozen packs to a carton. A hundred cartons or more. Looks like a couple of months' supply. Alles klar. Okay. Dankeschön. Oh. Die gestrige Folge L.A. Noir ist fertig. <lacht> ja. Tschüss. Alter, was war das? Kann ich die da wegschicken? This is a crime scene. All of you move along. So, die müssen noch nicht gehen. Someone gotta tell us what the hell. Clear this area immediately. Okay, einer, nee, ich wollte sagen, einer bleibt stehen. Please get away. Mal hier den, nee. Mülleimern ist wieder nichts. Gut, dann fahren wir mal. Can you drive to this one? Where are we going? Warte mal, wir fahren mal erst zum Revier. Wir gucken mal, was auf dem Schiff geklaut wurde. Vielleicht kann ich dann im Blue Room irgendwie noch was finden. Wieso läuft sie denn hier auf einmal lang? Hollywood Rivier. That fucking rat Stoker has gone public about Brenda. Who is Brenda? Brenda is LA's most famous madam. And everyone knows it? Of course everyone knows. Brenda pays her way. Are we cops or a collection agency? Ors have been around since the Bible. Our job is to keep it off the street so Joe Citizen and his wife can stroll around unmolested. Then we should change the law. Are you out of your mind? Every politician in America is against prostitution. Except when they're using them. So where does Stoker come in? He objects to the LAPD and the administration taking its cut. Is everyone in on this? Yeah, and that's the problem. From a little acorn does a large tree grow. He could bring the whole thing crashing down on us. 
Aren't you supposed to be working the... Sir, do you know which robbery detectives are working the army surplus theft from the Coolidge? Caldwell and McManus. I saw Caldwell in the squad room not long ago if you want to speak to him. Thank you, sir. We'll do that. This way. This way. Okay. Ja, das mit der, mit der Prostitution ziehen habe ich nicht so ganz verstanden. Harry, you got a minute? Sure, Cole, anytime. You've been working the docks robbery on the SS Coolridge? Yeah, that's right. So how do you see it? Inside job. Either the guys working the wharves or some of the guys on the ship. What else was taken apart from the morphine? Case of BARs, case of Thompsons, crate of Valor smokes. Homicide just recovered three BARs and a mountain of cigarettes at a shooting at the 111 Club. No kidding. I better get over there. Do you have a copy of the manifest? Yeah. Here it is. Mouthpiece or strips off me. So, how do we connect the docks robbery out. to the mess the at the 111 right Club? Driscoll, Hendrix. Here, Edward McGoldrick. Say, you bust in there and find the goddamn evidence. Kelso, Sheldon, Epstein, Hendrix. Kelso. This is the crate we recovered. Here's our backroom arsenal from the 111 Club. Enough to arm three companies. Morphine Tartar. Nein, das da drüber. Half a million surrets loose on the streets of LA. Yeah, I'm thinking so of these moving guys are from my old unit. I want to put them down one round. finally shipped home. Kelso, Sheldon. McGoldrick. McGoldrick was on the boat? Sure, we checked him out. McGoldrick bought the 111 Club, Harry. His brains are all over the bar. Looks like whoever stole the dope is getting muscled. By whom? Dragner or Cohen. They control the hop. Thanks, Harry. Stay in touch on this. Tja, vielleicht sollten wir uns mal mit unseren alten Kollegen treffen. Kelso, Sheldon. Parker, haben wir ja in der ein oder anderen Zwischensequenz aus den Zeitungen ja schon gesehen. Wobei die auch ziemlich Dreck am Stecken haben oder hatten. Wer weiß, ob sie rausgekommen sind. Was ist denn jetzt mit dir los? What? Wieso rennst du so? What the fuck? Wieso rennt denn er vor? Sorry. Ja, mein Freund, du kannst gleich mal fahren. You drive. I need to go over the case notes. Blue Room. Do we know where we're going? Blue Room. Bar. How well did you know the owner? McGoldrick? Well enough. He was in my unit. That's some cruel irony. You survive the war, then get blown to pieces back home. It happens more than you'd think. Young guys trying to adjust to normal life, getting mixed up in the wrong crowds. The kid had just bought a nightclub. I'd say he got mixed up in the right crowds. Until someone filled him full of holes. You don't come into that kind of money that quickly without pissing a few people off. Blue Room, 18.04 Uhr. Tja, kennen wir. Ja, danke. Wem erzählst du das eigentlich? Okay. Huh? Okay, aus der alten Frau wurde ein etwas jüngerer Mann. Und wieder ein anderer Mann. Und wieder eine Frau. Und wieder eine andere Frau. What the fuck? Und wieder eine andere Frau. Okay. <lacht> Hallo. Was ist das für ein Buch? I check coats. That's all I get paid to do. Eigentlich müssten die uns doch alle kennen. Ich sag mal, wir sind ja... Naja, Stammkunde nicht, aber regelmäßig zurückkommender Kunde. Genau wegen ihr hier. Take a break, boys. We would like them to stay, Miss Lickman. We're making inquiries into the recent deaths of four musicians. Since when have the police cared about dead black men? Good point. We don't. What we care about is two tons of army surplus morphine showing up on the street. 
If you care about working in this town, you better give me something on Biddleston and Bo. Or their knucklehead buddies, Tyree and Lamont. And this is your idea of making inquiries under Stonefurter? I've told you a thousand times about speaking that German gibberish at me, Elsa. Roy! How about you get a drink while I see to this? Will you sit down? Why antagonize him, Elsa? You know what he's capable of. Ask your questions, head officer. We have work to do. Elsa Lichtmann. Deutsche Exilantin und Nachtclub. N äh, Nazi, wollte ich gerade sagen. Jazzsängerin. So, Morphium aus dem Ar People are dying of overdoses. If you know anything about it, you need to tell me. I can't help you. A lot of cats are into the thing. There's nothing special about your boys. You can do this the easy way with me, or I can call my partner back over. I can assure you he's a lot less sensitive. You think your threats frighten me? Black man don't supply nothing. You think there's a black man in this town holding on to two tons of morphine? He'd be dead in a minute. White man supplies, black man buys. Mm -hmm. My partner mentioned a couple of names. You recognize them? I have no idea what you're talking about. The only way you're going to get rid of me is to give me an answer. I knew Cornell. We worked together a few years ago. He loved the music, but the music didn't love him. What does that mean? It means that he just wasn't that good. He was a sad, lonely cat. Boys, take five minutes, please. I need to have a private word with the officer. Why do you ask people to risk talking about a subject that could have them jailed? Drugs are against the law, Elsa. And you're so full of courage, you have never felt ashamed. This is getting us nowhere. Do you think you'll win your war against narcotics? It's not my war. It's against the law. My job is to prosecute the laws of this city. Do you think you can stop people from needing drugs, detective? I'm asking the questions here. Then why do you come to me with your stupid questions? You know who controls the drugs in this city. It's not enough to just survive, Elsa. You have to try and make the world a better place. Brave words. And very noble. But... Words are just words, Cole Phelps. She's right. We need to pay a visit to the mixer. Cohen? Do you know where to find him? This time of day? You'll find him holding court at the Macambo. He can wait. There's something I need to be sure of. Give me till tomorrow morning. Don't do anything I wouldn't do, partner. Blue Room, 22.34 Uhr. Mickey Cohn befragen, aber erstmal Elsa verfolgen. Elsa Lichtmann. Warum verfolge ich sie? Entschuldigung. Jetzt, fahr, jetzt fährt er wieder rechts und rechts. Und natürlich wird es direkt wieder rot. Okay, einmal links. Und es wurde rot. Fahren wir jetzt wahrscheinlich zu ihr nach Hause, oder? Ich verstehe doch nicht so ganz, was uns das bringen soll. Wow. Da war aber jemand unentschlossen. Oh, wo wäre er dann? Ja, Risk losing the trail.
Sie guckt nicht nach hinten. Strange. Ah, so. Okay. Das kommt den Leuten auf der Straße nicht verdächtig vor. Mocambo Club. 11.25 Uhr. LAPD, we're looking for Mayor Cohen. I believe he has lunch here. There's not going to be any trouble, is there? Which table? Number three. If you'll follow me. Natürlich. I think he's a bit of a gangster. Ja, ja, ja. Haben wir was mit der Elsa, wo wir verheiratet sind? Haben wir nicht sogar ein Kind? Ah ja. Oh, da ist er doch. Mickey. LAPD. We have some questions. Hi, Mickey. How's it hanging? Fine. Just fine, Roy. I see you brought Iga Beaver along. Hope he's not gonna put the shakes on me again. Cole Phelps. Mickey Cohen. Good afternoon. <laughs> He has manners. Aren't you a little green for this kid? Me, Johnny Stampanato, Cole. He has the biggest schlong in Hollywood and the smallest gun. Or maybe that's the other way around. I can never quite remember. You're a funny guy, Roy. Haven't I always said what a funny guy Roy is? And how much fun it would be to get together with him sometime. Poor Johnny. He's the dark sensitive type. He's a serviceman too, Cole. Johnny was in Okinawa. You were in the crotch? Sixth Marines. The lieutenant who won the Silver Star up on Sugarloaf. I've heard of you. Something like that. All right, have we finished flirting? You got something to discuss, Roy? Are you gonna stand around beating the meat while my lunch gets cold? We have some questions. Do I need my lawyer? Oh Gott, Alter, jetzt mit Mayor Harrison... Oh, wie ist eigentlich Mickey? Naja. Oh, mit dem zu quatschen, das wird ja auch schön. Your brother-in-law, Lenny Finkelstein, was selling stolen morphine. He had one-third of the shipment. Old news, kid. I don't know anything about what Lenny was up to. So I'm supposed to believe that you don't know what happened to the rest of the shipment. Lenny, God rest his soul, was a moron. He was family, though, and I haven't made a beef about that, so count yourself lucky, kid. The H is a filthy habit, and I don't condone it. The simple solution would be to have all the dope fiends put down. So you don't know where he got the morphine? Kid, ask a question you might get an answer to. Okay. We believe there's a link between a group of Marines and the morphine stolen from the SS Coolridge. One of those Marines was shot to death in a club last night. I wouldn't know anything about that. So you haven't heard anything about what happened at the 111 Club? What can I say, kid? I'm shocked that in the land of opportunity, Uncle Sam's finest feel the need to resort to crime. It's a dangerous business. I can attest to that. I'd recommend they get out of the life. Quickly. A few Negroes saying goodbye on the sidewalk will never make the papers, Mickey. But we had a judge in Pasadena say adios the other day. Prominent white people popping their clogs makes everyone nervous. You know dope has never been my thing, Roy. It's always been for schmendricks like uh, Jack D and Jimmy Utley. But uh, I'll ask around and I'll get back to you. Hey, you boys want some lunch? How about a drink? We'll take a rain check on that. Come on, Cole, we're leaving. We have to cut that dope. 
It looks bad with people dying. We have to get the rest of it. There's no way of watering down the stuff in those little packages. We have to put the squeeze on those guys and get the rest of it. They don't seem to type the fright in that easy. We'll see. Detectives, KGPL's going crazy. Shots fired at 1384 North Bronson. Some guy with an automatic spraying a Hollywood bus. They want every car. Go! I say we bust in there and find the goddamn What the fuck? Busschießerei? Okay. Vielleicht eine neue Spur zum restlichen Morphine? Ja, ich gehe mal davon aus, jetzt muss ich fahren. Ja, wir machen es einfach mal. Ich glaube, ich bin da ein bisschen fixer als Roy. So, komm, einsteigen. Here we go. Oh, da rennen sie aber schon. Wie die aufgescheuchten Hühner. Ja, wir sind schon auf dem Weg. Okay, auf dem Dach ist er also. Ach, hier sind wir auch schon. Unorthodoxe Fahrweise gerade. Scharfschütze durchsuchen. Also erstmal gucken wir uns die Waffe an. Ja, auch wieder so eine BRR. Äh, BAR. It's one of the BARs. Okay. Also eine weniger. Ja gut, das ist BAR im Magazin. Das macht jetzt nichts her. Ah, wen haben wir denn hier liegen? Na, Arm. Alles gut. Die other Arm. Aber wahrscheinlich auch nichts. Ja. Hat er denn irgendwas in der Taschen? Yes. 
Alvaro Root, Hollywood und Sunset zwischen 12 und 14 Uhr, Mokambo Tisch 3. Phone number and restaurant table. Hm, das ist doch erstaunlich. Wer saß denn an Tisch 3? War das ein gewisser Mickey Cohn? Alvaro. He's one of the guys from the ship. His name was on the manifest. Looks like McGoldrick wasn't the only one to get a message. Hey, Alvaro. Hey, Lieutenant. He's just a plain detective now, Chico. Who's the jughead? It's my partner, Roy Earl. We just want to find out what happened. What happened is that someone took a shot at my bus. And the cops turned up and started treating me like I'm some sort of pachuco punk. My people have been in California for over 300 years. Very fucking admirable, Felix. Wissen über Cool Ridge Raub. You hear anything about the big heist on the Cool Ridge? Yeah, I heard about it. So what happened? Not much. Uh, cops came and interviewed me and all the other guys on the ship. I was down at the 111 Club this morning, waiting for the medical examiner to scrape Eddie McGoldrick's brains off the bar. You want to tell me anything about that? I heard that Eddie came into some money. Too bad he didn't keep a low profile. It's a tough break to get through Okinawa and then have to buy it back home. Ja, wie ist er denn ein Geld gekommen? Who's shooting at you, Felix? How the fuck do I know? Felix, we didn't go through Okinawa to come back to this on our streets. I've got the LAPD to keep me safe, right? Me and all my people. Shit. We'll be in touch, Felix. You heard that Jack is in LA? I saw his name on the manifest. He's been here a couple of months. Sure glad to see you got over your wound, Lieutenant. I mean, Detective. Jack Kelso. Pretty cool customer. He's been under fire before. You buying a story? Not for a minute. Oh, ich kann telefonieren. Zufälligerweise steht hier wieder ein Telefon. Phelps Batch 1247. Phelps 1247. Ah. How could I help, Detective? I need an address on a Jack Kelso. Just a second. Jack Kelso, apartment 4, 1408 North El Centro Avenue, Hollywood. Thanks. Ah, das wird ja jetzt schön, unseren alten Freund wiederzusehen. Fahrer, bringe mich! You're behind the wheel. Zu Fine. Herrn Where are we headed? Kelso. Jack Kelso. Officer, please tell me what's going on. Ja, hier ist alles zerlöchert. Ich denke, es erklärt sich, was hier passiert ist. Jack was a company sergeant. He would never get involved in something like this. We brace him and drag him downtown. Won't work. He's a tough customer. Kelso's apartment, 14.12 Uhr. Hello, Jack. This is Detective Roy Earl. Hello, Cole. We would like a word. Would you like to come inside? Actually, we'd prefer if you'd come downtown with us. Do you mind? Do I have any choice? No. You don't. Are you going to tell me what this is all about? It would be better for all of us if we discussed it at the station. Bad move, Cole. How have you been, Jack? Cut the crap. Pick me up in front of my apartment like a common criminal and then expect small talk? Fuck you. Verhör in Hollywood. 15.35 Uhr. Do you know that there's a gang war going on in LA trying to recover that stolen morphine? That has nothing to do with me. 
I'm sure it would be gripping to hear more of your life story, boys, but the truth is, I don't give a fuck. You were on the boat, Kelso. What happened? Do you really think a bunch of Marines could muscle in on the dope rackets in this town? Between the vice squad and the mob, I hear it's pretty sewn up. You'd better watch your mouth. Mm -hmm. Did you know that Eddie McGoldrick recently came into money and bought a nightclub? No, I didn't know that. And you didn't know that some mobsters blew his brains out last night? No, I didn't. Oh, okay, what's up, Christmas? You heard that a crate of BARs went missing? No, I didn't. Boah, der sieht so... Also, ich glaub's ihm fast, aber... Yeah. I saw Felix Alvaro today. Good. How was he? A little pale. One of Mickey Cohen's goons had emptied about 60 BAR rounds into the bus he was driving. A public bus in the middle of Hollywood. Are you going to tell me what's going on? Or do more innocent people have to die? Yeah, and what's in it for you, Cole? Newspapers? More glory? Another promotion, another medal at the expense of men who fought for their country? Count me out. Hmm. What do you know about the army surplus robbery from the Cool Ridge, Jack? What I know is that on three separate occasions you would have been dead if it weren't for me. I don't know anything about the robbery. People are dying because morphine intended to help servicemen is being used on the street. Now we have guys from our old unit being killed by mobsters. We can put two and two together, Jack. Gratitude isn't a concept that has much effect on you, is it, Cole? Answer the question, Jack. Let's get this over with. I was interviewed when the robbery took place. I don't have anything further to add. Jack, we just want information. Bullshit, Cole. Did you seriously believe that dragging me down here would get me to give up my own guys? You call yourself a Marine? Trying to make a name for yourself with this shit heel? Look at this chump with his $200 suit and $2,000 car. The tough guy act is really impressive. I like you, Jack. I'd like to make you for this. I really would. I'm going to be working on it and keeping an eye on you. You can go now. Shooting Robert Steiner, 6780 West Sunset Boulevard. The victim is a Chris Majewski. Another name from the manifest? Wird er jetzt alle Marines erschossen? How many more friends are yours going to get mugged today? Ach, ach, wahrscheinlich um herauszufinden, wo. Talk about tension. That was like being trapped in an elevator with a married couple who can't decide whether they love each other or hate each other. We go back a long way. You went too easy on him. Next time, you leave it to me. I know how to handle that smug son of a bitch. You don't. Jack will never give up his own men. Ja, wahrscheinlich wollen sie rausfinden, wo die letzten, oder letzten, ja, zwei Drittel von dem, von dem Morphium sind. Ist. They just walked up and shot the man. Two of them officers, they went that way. Go on, get after him. I can't hit a target that isn't there, Phelps. Ah, the funny shit moment, man. Getting close, steer him off the tar. Keep it steady, and I'll try to bust his tires. I can't take the shot from here, Cole. Hit him, Cole. Spin him out. Oh. I'll try for the tires. Keep your foot down. Hit him. Clear the path on the road. Alter Schwede, schieß doch. It's no good. We need to get closer. Warum bin ich eigentlich das einzige Polizeiauto, was hier lang fährt? 
an, ich hänge. Alter Schwede. So, die nächsten BARs. Ja, gut. Okay, wir sind uns einig. Es ist eine BAR. Hat der auch wieder einen Zettel dabei? <lacht> Sogar einen Brief dabei. Oh, ah, kick mal an. Er hat die gesamte Liste einfach am Start. Inklusive Adressen. Beckett, Higgins, Connolly, Ein LAPD-File. Wir haben einen Trader in unserem Midst. All of the names on the list have a hit team assigned to them. Echt? A hit team? Scheiße, Alter. Zum Glück sind wir auf der Liste nicht drauf. Äh, hallo? Mickeys Treffen um 21 Uhr beim News View Ge äh, Gebäude. Sheldon. Bitte zu. Sheldon. Cohen is meeting with Sheldon tonight. What? We need to get to those guys fast, otherwise there'll be no case. Ja, ich muss mir ganz kurz die Zeitung da angucken. LAPD Weiß Scandal könnte es nach ganz oben reichen. We have to look at damage limitation. We can't allow that strumpet Brent Allen to bring down the whole administration. We've got to put a lid on the press. Can someone talk to Harry over at the Times? It's too late. The Times would look ridiculous if we drop the story now. Who is this Stoker? Stoker's a lily white. Nothing that will fix this in the short term. My law and order credentials are disappearing as we speak. Can we get Brenda to leave town? Yes, we can, but she won't go quietly. Brenda has extensive records. Can she at least lay low? That's already been taken care of. Mayor? District Attorney? Who is this guy? And what does he want, Horrell? The name's Roy Earl, detective, administrative vice. Aren't you one of the clowns that got us into this mess? Oh, I think that the orders regarding Brenda come down, not up, Mayor. I have a human interest story. It involves a certain LAPD cop, a hero from the war, who has let his beautiful wife and kids down, who has betrayed America for a German junkie whore who has abandoned his pledge to the LAPD and his commitment to the public, we all serve. It's gonna be all over the papers by tomorrow, and you would be off the hook. So what do you want in return, Roy? Fingering a fellow officer? What the fuck? So, können wir uns mal ganz kurz mit ihm unterhalten? Any ideas? The post office call and be quick about it. Okay, wahrscheinlich steht das nicht ganz so drin, ne? Alter! Hat er uns echt verpfiffen? Und wir sind jetzt der Sündenbock für diese Brenda Sache, die ich übrigens nicht so ganz verstanden habe, bin ich ehrlich. Fuck. The post office. Taking out all the guys from the ship. Why? How does I get them to know? They obviously don't know who has the morphine. And they're waiting for someone to crack. Genau. Okay, dann habe ich ja doch das Richtige im Sinn gehabt. Also suchen einfach genau äh, sich alle aus, bis einer weiß, wo die restlichen Sachen rumliegen. Da ist ja schon Polizei. Oh Mann, fuck.
Leid. Alter Schwede. So. Übrigens, ich weiß nicht, es, es klingt nach einer Tommy Gun, ich sehe aber nicht eine einzige. So, weiter bitte. Achso, weiter. Wer schießt denn hier? Endlich. So. Ich hoffe, jetzt ist es mal ein bisschen ruhiger. Okay, rein geht's. Take cover, you lunatic! Mann, Alter. Der Tommy Gun Boy. Wahnsinn. Der hat einen Zettel in der Hand. Oh, der lebt sogar noch. Ach, das ist Courtney. Oh Gott, was war das denn? Ich glaube, das war nicht gewollt, dass ich ihn schon anfasse. Danny Finkelstein. Pol oh nein, Polar Bear Eisfabrik. Polar Bear Ice Company. They really did it. Wonder whether it was worth it. Most people never get the chance to be rich. Wouldn't you risk it? Oh, das war ja creepy, Alter. Erstmal schön den noch Lebenden. <lacht> oh Gott, ist das makaber. Fuck, Alter. Kann ich hier noch irgendwas machen? Wahrscheinlich nicht, wa? Äh, Roy? Ich denke mal, wir fahren zur zum nächsten Tatort war. Your other dead war buddy. You check his pockets too? Nein. Because I can't. Ich möchte nicht noch mal sein Gesicht, vor allem, wie er noch gesprochen hat. Ich kann seine Pockets nicht nehmen. Also nicht nehmen. Seine Pockets nicht überprüfen. Das geht nicht. Ich kann nicht in seine Taschen gucken. Warum denn? Ja, ja, Polar Bear Ice Company, alles gut. Ich kann nicht in seine Taschen gucken, es tut mir leid. So, sorry, musst du noch mal einen kurzen Cut machen? What the fuck ist denn mit diesem Spiel verkehrt? Was ist er denn für ein Künstler? Alter, er steht, <lacht> er steht einfach auf dem Spiegel. Okay, ich weiß nicht, ich glaube, ich habe das Spiegel gecrashed. Hallo! So, jetzt. Was hast, hast du denn irgendwas? Wahrscheinlich hast du auch eine Liste, ne? Da auf jeden Fall nicht. Naja. Treffen mit Cohen und Sheldon. Später heute Nacht. Okay. Looks like Sheldon is bringing his own fire team with him. Was? Juicy, Beckett, Goldrick, Driscoll. These are good guys. Why did they get wrapped up in this thing? Okay. Ach so, lebt er eigentlich? Not everyone has your unwavering restraint in the face of temptation, Cole. Oh, er lebt doch noch. Ich 
Phelps, er lebt noch. Er bewegt sich. Tell Courtney. Bad luck. Hä? Das kann doch... Also irgendwie sind Fehler an diesem Spiel jetzt gerade. Polar Bear Ice Company. Really did it. Wonder whether it was worth it. Most people never get the chance to be rich. Wouldn't you risk it? I don't know. So, und ich kann nicht in seine Taschen gucken, ja? So, mein Freund, was empfiehlt's mir jetzt? I'm at a loss. We need to get the Graumans before all these guys get whacked. Okay, Graumans. Wo auch immer das jetzt wieder ist. Also nicht in die Taschen meines Kumpels sollte ich gucken, sondern in die von dem Schützen. Mann, ey. Nächster. Wahrscheinlich wird auch der nicht überleben. This isn't looking good. I feel like the fat kid at the back of a race. You sure it's Cohen making the hits? All fingers point his way. Your buddies are in way over their heads. Being a Marine doesn't mean shit out here. Ja, das stimmt allerdings. Oh, neues Fahrzeichen. Dass man hier Marine ist, juckt kein. In so einer ja, Stadt, wo alles schon verteilt ist. Romans Chinese Theater, 19.12 Uhr. Ah, jetzt werden die auf offener Straße erschossen. Getting close and steer them off the tar. Jeez. Entschuldigung. Damit habe ich nicht gerechnet. Schön mit der Sonne da. Also wenn die Sonnenstrahlen nicht ab und zu mal so komisch aussehen würden. I can't hit a target that isn't there, Phelps. Hit it. Clear this asshole off the road. Let's see how fast he runs on bare rims. LAPD, put your hands in the air. Oh Gott. Noch mehr Tote. Gut, dann gibt es ja nur noch einen Ort, wo wir jetzt hin können. Nämlich zum Treffpunkt. Also, gut. Oder aufs Revier. Aber die Verabredung zwischen Sheldon und... Mann, ey. Und Mickey. Ach, was war denn Kelsos Rolle eigentlich in diesem ganzen Spiel? War das nicht auch in den Zeitungen irgendwie zu sehen? Naja, okay. Wir lassen uns mal überraschen, wie es jetzt weitergeht. Okay, hier geht's nicht weiter. Treffpunkt 21.15 Uhr. Oh, Keep moving, I'll cover you. On the roof, call nail them. 
Alter, was war das? Sehr gut. Alter, hat das gar überlebt. Krass. Hallo. Na, komm raus. Komm raus. Stay in cover! They're making a run for it after them! Hopeless is Scheiße, Alter, ich brauch mal eine neue Knarre. Komm schon, komm schon. Run, buddy, run. Komm schon, überleben. Ich werde einen APB auf jeden einer der Sons der Bitches auf dem Weg. APB auf Car 11K, Car 11 King, komm in. Car 11 King. 11K, go to Hollywood Station. Hey, Courtney Sheldon is at Hollywood Station requesting an interview with Detective Cole Phelps. Well, I'll be damned. That's not correct protocol, 11K. I'll take that as a roger. Car 11 King en route. Ach du Scheiße. Okay, Courtney stellt sich anscheinend. So. Ei, ei, ei. Was schon wieder für einen Auftrag? Ja, Mickey ist raus. Also, Mickey ist abgehauen. Raus ist er nicht. Sheldon stellt sich. Keine Ahnung, ob der ein bisschen gesprächiger ist als ähm, Kelso. Aber wahrscheinlich schon, sonst würde er sich ja nicht freiwillig bei uns auf dem Revier melden. Tja, dann gucken wir mal. Wahrscheinlich will er Schutz haben, weil er Angst hat. Macht ja Sinn. Roy, in my office, if you please. I'm working a major case. I'm not close, Cap. It's gonna have to wait. Let Phelps do the interrogation. But, Cap, no buts. This is more important. Oh, God. Das hat bestimmt was mit diesen Verpfeifen zu tun. Put him down, my staff. Wo ist er denn? You're an interview too, Phelps. There's a quack in there with him. Oh, What nee. Gives? Nein. It's me. Word came down from the chief. Said it was okay. Oh, oh nicht der Arzt. I think his name is Phelps. Sheldon. I read about him in the newspaper. Is this your attorney? No, detective. This is Dr. Harlan Fontaine. He came down here to help me out. How do you do, sir? You stole the morphine from the Cool Ridge. You can't prove that. Let's see if I can try. And what is your relationship to Sheldon, sir? Tudor mentor. Mr. Sheldon is a medical student of mine. He has a very bright future. Oh, that's nice to know. Too bad all of your war buddies won't get to see your graduation. I would have asked Beckett or Majewski or Driscoll about their involvement, but that's difficult, considering they're all dead. That leaves you, Sheldon. You can't blame their deaths on me, Phelps. Naja, können wir nicht wirklich, ne? Obwohl doch, Beckets Geständnis. Doch. You're lying, Courtney. The other guys aren't smart enough to attempt something like this. You either give it up, or I go after Jack for it. And how do you prove that, Cole? Beckets Geständnis, ja, das können wir mal versuchen. Jack isn't scared of you, Phelps. None of us were. We just followed your orders. Shit. You were on the ship, Sheldon. Yes, that's correct. So you had opportunity. But it doesn't mean that I was involved. Doch jetzt aber. So you don't mind that the mob executed McGoldrick, Driscoll, and Beckett to get to you? I don't know why you're trying to pin this on me. Where's your proof? Jetzt aber das mit dem Beckets Geständnis. 
Beckett had a message for you before he died. Bad luck. It was worth a try. I feel bad about Beckett, Phelps. He was a hard charger. Those guys deserve more. I don't blame them for taking their shot. Have you finished, detective? I'm just getting started. You have an answer for everything, Courtney. Let's hope Jack does, because now I'm going after him. Is there anyone you're not prepared to sacrifice? Jack is not in this. He's a good guy. You were Jack, Courtney. I don't care who goes to jail. I just want the morphine off the street. What are you offering, Cole? Don't be ridiculous, son. This man is gambling. What's your offer? Doctor! Good to see you. I'm conducting an investigation. Upstairs in my office, now. This man is about to confess. As of now, you're suspended from duty, pending a fitness review. What are you talking about? You heard the man, Phelps. Upstairs and face the music like the hero you wear. You certainly had us fooled, Detective. Phelps, you're one of my favorite sons. You've broken this old man's heart. Sir, what is going on here? You're suspended, Phelps. And over your badge and gun. Don't keep him waiting. What is going on here? Your wife's attorney has pictures of you and the German. Compromising pictures, lad. She's pressing charges. You'll be formally charged with adultery. A criminal cannot serve as an LAPD officer, as I'm sure you're aware. I don't understand. How could you do it, lad? Your wife. Your children. Consorting with the enemy and a dope fiend at that. You're lucky the war is over. You'd be taken out and shot. The department doesn't need this kind of publicity, Phelps. Hand over the gun. Keep your head down until your board hearing. I forbid you to make any comments to the press. What the hell were you thinking? Listen, Marie, I need to explain. Please leave. You're upsetting the girls. Let me see them, Marie. They're my daughters. Go to her, Cole. You have done enough damage here. Do you want me to call the police? For God's sake, Marie. Can't we at least talk? What is there to talk about? Do you love her? Do you? What were you thinking? What about our children? Can you imagine what this has been like for them? Go away, Cole. My father has hired an attorney and you will be hearing from him. I'd like to explain, Marie. I'd like to tell you what I've been going through. What you've been going through. I have had reporters camped out on the front lawn all morning. I can't stand it, Cole. Manifest Destiny. Sitten der Zahn hat abgeschossen, aber es wegen der Taten degradiert, macht sich bereit für eine Versetzung. Und zwar Richtung Brandermittlungen Wilshire Revere, Revere. Wilshire Revere Division 7. So, erstmal zum Fall 7. Vier Sterne. Ein Hinweis haben wir nicht gefunden, zwei falsche Antworten oder Fragen. 
Je nachdem, gestellt. 40 Dollar Schaden nur? Ach, Sachschaden gibt's so. Okay. Um einen Marine wie Felix dazu zu bringen, seine Kumpel zu verraten, braucht man Geschick und solide Beweise. Ja, das fällt mir immer noch ein bisschen schwer. Aber viel dramatischer ist ja tatsächlich die Entwicklung um Cole Phelps und sein Privatleben. Wobei, ja, obwohl, eigentlich ist es relativ eindeutig, ich wollte gerade sagen, wobei man ja nicht so wirklich weiß, was die beiden machen, vielleicht unterhalten sie sich ja auch nur, aber, ja, keine Ahnung. Und unser lieber Freund, der Ray, hat uns ja, Roy, nicht Ray, Roy hat uns ja da schön verpfiffen und uns zum Sündenbock quasi degradiert. Bin sehr gespannt, wie es im Ermittlungs- oder Brandermittlungskommissariat weitergeht. Heißt das so, Brandermittlungs- ja, Kommissariat heißt das, glaube ich, ne? Ja. Denke mal. Wir werden sehen.